Hey yo, welcome back to another video boys, Mike here, and today guys, we'll be covering a new dev blog that just got released this morning from Administrator Nara, the lead developer for Platinum 5. Now he mentioned that this dev blog both recaps Operation Resurgence, but also some new feature announcements. So with that being said, we're not going to be covering every single little thing they said in the dev blog, I'll be just doing highlights that I think was interesting to myself. I'm going to be posting the dev blog in the description down below and maybe the comment section. So make sure you guys just scroll down there and you can have a view for yourself. So with that being said, let's dive straight into this one. They kick it off with the introduction from their community manager. He goes on to say that it's been a while since the last development blog and they're looking forward to being more connected with the community. And I appreciate them taking in the feedback that I gave to them or criticism, whatever you want to call it on that last video I did with the whole community. So it's nice to see him posting some dev blogs, surveys and all that. So I'm looking forward to this. He goes on to say that there's going to be more types of surveys to be put out in the future and i encourage you all to get involved if you would like to influence the development of brm5 so this is great news for everyone who wants to have a say in what's going on uh pretty much he says furthermore we'll be focusing on engaging with the community more through our social media with sneak peeks polls and promotion of community generated content so we can ultimately be more transparent with brm's development and i know a lot of you guys are gonna be happy from that because i know it's been tough for the last year about this whole like hype to operation resurgence but guys it's gonna be good they're working on it and this is clear clear progress on what they're doing right here so this is very good news for all of us they later go on to have a nice warm welcome for the new developers that are joining the brm5 dev team of course now i'm not gonna be covering what they said but if you'd like to view it like i mentioned it's in the description down below so moving on now we're at a point in the dev log where administrator nar and the other developers will be discussing new content and features that will be arriving into brm5 in the near future so with that being said one of them is going to be a new securable objective in open world that will later be released in mid-february like on the screen here you could have a pause at it and just have a read pretty much it's going to be something new for you guys to grind up to and uh, work on I know many players have asked about the small compounds and what happened to them, but pretty much what he's trying to say here is that there's going to be something brand new for you guys to do instead of those small compounds. So that's pretty cool. Administrator Nar later goes on to say that skydiving will come back in the next patch. Also, there's going to be a community poll regarding the re-implementation of the down slash revive system. And the faces, I know that has got a lot of backlash, but what they're trying to say here is they don't want to revert it to the actual old, old face. But what they want to do is have a new one, but isn't the same one that you see currently in the game. So something that makes Beerum 5 stand out and make it unique. Panda with no name later goes on to add to what Nar was mentioning about the dynamic progression system, saying that there's many planned weapons and skins that you will also be able to obtain exclusively through this method. So that means that only through this method that they're talking about, you will only be able to get skins, camos, weapons, whatever it is this one's coming in hot from mb sniper he's mentioning that there's going to be some new vehicles that will be joining the bigger and five lineup now specifically this is this is hyping me up because honestly i love vehicles in this game i love the aircrafts pretty much he mentioned be prepared to diversify your armories with a whole host of internationally fielded vehicles ranging from light attack vehicles to armored personnel carriers so i can't wait for this i'm excited let me know in the comment section if you guys are excited for this hell yeah this one's coming in from KitKat, and pretty much what he's mentioning is the RGE in BRM5. Now, in case you guys do not know what this is leading up to, it's the Zeus mechanic that I think you guys have heard about a thousand times. This is going to be huge for BRM5, and if they're able to nail this out of the ballpark, then pretty much BRM5 will be one hell of a game for Roblox. I'm just putting it out there. Like, if you, I may do a video on just this, like, what Kit said here about the RGE slash Zeus mechanic mode. This is huge huge for brm5 so i can't wait for this you can have a pause you can have a read of what kit said but uh yeah this is this is crazy man all right boys so that's gonna wrap up the dev blog here like i said you could have a look at it in the description down below i did miss out on some information i didn't cover it in this video but i just took the things that i found out to be very interesting and very cool so with that being said if you enjoyed it hit that like button subscribe if you're new join the discord in the description down below that being said catch you guys in the next one peace out